everybody. We're here at the Las Vegas Convention Center in Wrangler Studio. And today on Off the Dirt with Alexis Bloomer, we have none other than world champion Strand Smith and TV personality, rodeo extraordinaire, everything, <laughs> Jennifer Smith. Oh, yeah. So we're so glad to have you guys with us today. Oh, thanks and we're us. kind of promoting Elevation Sunday because that's coming up and it's such a great event that happens every year at the National Finals Rodeo. So can you tell us a little bit about what it is? Sure. Um, 14 years ago, mm -hmm. um, a friend of ours that rodeoed with Strand had an idea to have a Wrangler NFR caliber World Series yeah. church service. So there was lots of little small meetings, mm -hmm. but nothing big. So it's basically a volunteer committee, cowboys and families and fans come together. Um, and just an inspirational service that can feed the cowboys to get them through the rest of the week. Okay, so and then fans can come, right? Oh, it's yes. not just open to cowboys. Absolutely, so it's at the it's MGM. Cowboys, families, and fans, and uh, we have some loyal fans that are there every year at the Copperfield Theater. Yes, Copperfield Theater. Okay, and what time does it start? It starts at 10:45. Okay, and we usually try to finish at noon so everybody can get lunch and get to autograph signings. Awesome, that's great. And Strand, you're actually preaching at it this year, and you're with Aaron Watson which is such a great group I think yeah it is uh, you know I'm uh, I'm excited to hear listen to Aaron and Yancey yeah. sing and uh, we got a really special guest this this uh, this year mm -hmm. with uh, we've got a choir that's oh going to sing his backup. No so a gospel right choir Vegas, that's yeah. coming oh, to sing. Oh, that's going to be amazing. And it's that's so, so moving. And out here, I feel like Vegas has been through a lot recently with the tragic events that happened in October. And I feel like this church service has always been something that's just so uplifting and it's positivity in the midst of chaos in Las Vegas. It is. And that's, that's kind of what, uh, that's kind of the theme this year is, you know, what, what is our purpose in all of this crazy life that we live and how we can maybe, you know, step back and, uh, look at each and every one of us how we reflect on ourselves and really how that starts with more than anything it's not really with me it's with you know reflecting on my way that I relate to the father and how bad he wants to have a relationship with us I completely agree I couldn't agree more and you know you have such a great testimony a great story can you give us a hint about anything he that we might did. expect he did give us a hint he gave us a can, we get, <laughs> can we give another hint just something that fans can expect you know that if they've never been for your first experience what was it like uh, you know, it, it was, it really was, like Jennifer said, it was an uplifting, you know, time to be able to sit back and relax and just be able to let, uh, just be able to praise and worship and just be able to uh, be fed and with uh, no pressure, be able to let the Lord speak and, and have His will and have His way in our lives. And, you know, whether that be, uh, whether you're a person there that's working at the MGM or you're a contestant or you're a family member, or no, no matter what you you're doing, but where God has you in your in 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 His uh, purpose yeah. and your walk. And I have to brag on Aaron Watson in a minute yes. because when I told him that Strand was speaking, I said, "No pressure. I know you are so busy, but would you be interested?" Because Strand and Aaron are pretty good friends. Yes. And he he didn't text me back for a little bit, and he said, uh, "You know, he he is." grown to enormity in our oh, industry definitely. you know the first independent artist to be on the billboard charts yes. and top the charts and anyway he responded I talked to Jesus and he said yes oh I love that <laughs> and so he's just so humble and for him to bless us and be there we're just super excited well I'm excited too and I know the fans are gonna love it it is open to the public so be sure to go out to the Copperfield Theater at the MGM Grand 10 45 a.m. tomorrow you have to make it he's gonna give us a great sermon and also Aaron Watson's gonna be singing and Jennifer will be there so you won't want to miss and it. And if by chance you're not in Las Vegas, yes, the Wrangler Network is going to okay. air it later mm -hmm. Sunday afternoon. Perfect. So, yeah. so you will not have an excuse to miss it. That's right. It's everywhere. So thank you guys so much and thank you guys for tuning in. Be sure to come by our live set every day in Cowboy Christmas any time of the day. So.